Welcome to Dan ARG YouTube. Talk Amasi B with Apostle Alfred Uyinosa. This na press conference concerning land grabbing for Edo State. Make I leave you, make you hear from Esosa Ewere, Kolai Dokbayi, Comrade Stanley Osaze Osakwino Kodi, and Apostle Alfred Uyinosa, the man with the Talk Amasi B. Have you been live? Is it going to be the father? Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah. Uh -huh. Have you started? We are live already. People are already live from this. Oh, that right. Yeah. This this center like no different. Okay. So let's uh, okay. So can we can we start? Yeah, thank you. Uh, gentlemen and lady of the press. <laughs> a dope people, a dope people at home and abroad. We want to thank you so much for joining us from your various locations in this uh, WordPress conference being organized by the concerned citizens of Edo State, especially as it concerns the issue of. Uh, the devilish and draconic land grabbing and other illegal land deals in Edo State. We have been in this struggle in the last one month and we believe that this struggle, this agitation has come to stay. Not only because it is being uh, championed by us, but because a lot of Edo citizens at home and abroad have found one or two reasons, either because they have been victims of uh, land grabbing or because they have chosen to speak or to lend their voice for those who are unable to speak for themselves in this struggle. I want to respectfully thank you for joining us this morning and I want to assure you that this conference is bid to look into critical issues of recommendations and uh, other issues which we will be passing across to authority to ensure that the needful is done and the devilish acts of land grabbing becomes a thing of the past in our dear states. I will now be passing the microphone to my brother and friend, the PRO of this great organization, Comrade Stanley Osaze, who will take the discussion up from there. Thank you so much and God bless. I want to say a very big thank you to my brother, our brother, our friend, the most respected comrade 
a suicide were uh, distinguished members of the press edo people at home and in the diaspora we thank you all and uh, we all know our collective challenge which is land grabbing in Edo State. We always agree to the fact that land grabbing can create huge insecurity, economic imbroglio, and other problem, even on timely death, another problem that may militate against the progress of every contemporary urban society. I need to be laconic and direct to the point. I want to bring in the leader, the coordinator general, our own faculty of peace, Mr. Kelly, to give us details about the World Press Conference. But well, before that, we have to sing our song. Let's start. We shall overcome. We shall overcome. We shall overcome. Africa. I want to respectfully appreciate everybody that is here today, especially the the press and all the gallant men and women of concerned citizen of a do state. Um, we don't go straight to the business. The secretary, Komedewere, have said a lot. And, and our great PRO have also thrown light in what we are about to do today. So I will read the communique that we are issuing. This is a World Press Conference, and I want to get the men of the press to follow. Consigned citizen of a do state, mm -hmm. land grabby, a, a Deadly cankerworm to the social, economic, cultural, and infrastructural development of a people, and why government must act now. Being a World Conference delivered by Consent Citizen of Edo State Monday, 23rd of August 2021, Ozaba Lane, off Airport Road, Benin City. We wish to thank the Almighty God for making us to see this day a, remark a remarkable day in the history of our struggle and agitation. We are indeed extremely grateful to patriotic and those home and abroad who share in the ideas and philosophy of the movement and they continue to make significant contribution toward its success. The hundreds of victims of land grabbing who have shown immense, immense co cooperation and severity by following their cases legally and brought forward their petition deserve special recognition. It is our sincere belief that this effort hit positive results in, in your ultimate search for justice and rest assured that we stand with you and we continue to do our best to see you smile again. The concerned citizen of Edo State, a pressure group that draw huge membership from all walks of life, including both, including but not limited to political, entertainment, religious, economy, academic, etc. Today, present a world press conference to forge a new direction for land administration regulation in a do state. In a do state. This becomes necessary in the face of incessant evil and draconic act of land grabbing, illegal encroachment, grass 
demolition of developed properties by community leader, sales of parcel to multiple persons are under under head land D in our dear state, which have no doubt flood and hinder meaningful development and investment drive in a do state. As a group that draw membership from as a group that draw membership across the board, we have received more than 10,000 petitions, hard and soft copy petitions from victims of illegal, de illegal deeds occurring in various communities in a do state, particularly Benin City. We have staged the anti-land grabbing protest a fortnight ago, Monday, 9th August 2021, to be pre precisely. During which some of the petitions were submitted on behalf of the victim to the Deputy Governor of Edo State, right? Honorable Komish Shaibu, who in his statement affirmed that the Edo State government will come heavily on land grabbing, grabbers, irrespective of position or class. We wish to state clearly and equivocally that the campaign now spread by good spirited and those stayed home and abroad. It is bigger than one single individual. And so, and so must not be seen as a wish hunt against a particular individual or group of persons. But it is a conscious focus, deliberate, result oriented, direction, dire, directional movement, conceptualized to consolidate on the effort of God in of God, number second, uh, led administration in fight against devious, demonic, and devilish act of land grabbing by extension, open up heater to close area of a do state to indigenous, local, and foreign investors who may have long be who have long been scared of by unpopular tendency in our community. We want also we, want, we wish to condemn in very strong terms. The action of the police deployed to the Mission Grand on the day of our mass movement, or citing them at the early hour of the day, we, we, we had joy in our heart, only for them to lock us up at the Mission Gate, preventing the Speaker of the House of our, and or the Speaker of the House and hundreds of peaceful protesters for carrying out uh, carrying out the legitimate activities. We believe that the Commissioner of Police at those State, Command Philip Ubadu, cannot be unaware of this of this unpopular development, as we were told that the order to lock us to lock us in, to lock Mr. Speaker in, and us came from order from above. However, the the, the gate were open after much intervention. Shockingly, the Commissioner of Police have not deemed fit to reach out to this group. To at least show sign of remorse for the grass display of, of unprofessionalism by his men, we are watching, and we thereby say, this is not the first time the commissioner of police at those state is perpetrating this kind of undemocratic act. Mm -hmm. We are in a democracy, like we said, in democracy, protest is a political tool to attract public sympathy in a democratic society. And because of that, we therefore issue ultimatum to the CP of a state. We yet thereby give him 20, 48 hours to come up publicly to apologize to a state citizen who faithfully come out on that day to exercise their democratic right. We wrote him a letter we appeal to him that we were coming on that day and we solicit for a security coverage. Instead of him to give us a security coverage, we heard something must have happened because we are not yet gotten the full grasp of the information that the rumor that is flying around. We will come out and our legal team will do that later. That after 24, 48 hours, if he fail to do the needful, he should expect a mass protest that we demand for him to do so by using the legitimate mid of protest to drive home our, our concern. We want to also appreciate the great 
about Benin for his, his drive and get the CDA in 2016. Thereby, we have seen the collaboration between him and our able governor. We are unaware that in 2017, private, we are, we are, we are aware that in 2017, private property protection law signed by those state governor, Mr. Gordon Obaseki, was largely in, in investigations in dealing decisively with land criminals. Hence the need for amendment in 2021. Believe it be the PPP law 2021 has amended with several superlative ingredients attached for effective justiciable dispensation. We will be able to deal decisively with criminals element who have mastered the evil art of land grabbing and sales of, of peace to multiple persons scaring off investors who may, who may be willing to join in a door economy expansion by extension, causing physical, psychological, emotional trauma in land developers, leading, leading sometimes to solicited uh, debt, or solicited debt. We have seen that so many people have lost their life, even in recent time, occasion to issue of land grabbing. Gentlemen of the press, you are duly aware of this uh, event. We are also aware that Edo State House of Assembly investigate, in, Investigative Committee in, inaugurated by the Speaker to wade into land fiasco between the Ohen of Okoromi, Obok and Kevi Binovia and Psychiatric Hospital Cooperative Society have had first sitting where, where the Ohen and its representative alongside the Cooperative Society and their Representative, we are physically present. Why we commend the Speaker of, of Edo State, Right Honorable Marcos Unobu, for joining the Monday night protest and his proactive response to the yearning of, of yearning and cries of the poor, oppressed and suppressed with the prompt inauguration of the committee. It is expected that the Agbaje led committee will fearlessly uphold the idea of truth and justice and ensure that poor, voiceless, un unconnected members of a state public who have been severely bossed to the corner by land grabbers get justice and the criminal element, deadly front established law, face full rot of the law. We are equally unaware of the convinced of top traditional functionary a good, number of, a good number of whom operate from the inner chambers of the palace of our highly revised Oba. This functionary constantly massage the back of the land grabber to ease their stock in trade. These functionaries often time go as far as using a monobad name to execute such disgraceful and criminal trade. We do not, we do not want to believe that our highly revised Oba is aware of this ugly development. Oba yes. talk hey. Yes, Hence, little or no action has been taken to correct this dastardly act. We strongly believe that following this revelation, the Omonoba Nedo Ukbu Akpolo Polo by Ewari the second Oba Benin will rise up to the task of protecting those he swore to to defend upon taking the mantle of Obashi in 2016. We must forbid and punish element who deploy, who deploy instrumentality of our traditional institution to perpetrate evil and gaze hardworking and those. He said, it is sad that person in the name of Okayeli, Ohen, and like, who ought to defend, promote, and protect our rich cultural heritage in their various communities, continue to deploy instrumentality of their traditional regalia to stifle people, the Benin traditional institution, and other palace must rise up in this regard to properly scrutinize the character, disposition of, of person they wish to throw into forefront as a traditional representative. 
the palace and Edo State government must develop a practical and effective measure to manage and regulate land, land in Community. communities. Those who are transmogrified tra tra from the deadly CDA to Ohen, Ohen's exporting the same destructive tendency into Ohenship and their sponsor must not be allowed to strive in their in their deadly, dangerous, and obnoxious, of 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 unorthodox methodologies in the regulation and management of land in communities. More worrisome is the revelation as to the huge support and patronage land grabbers get from supposed political and traditional leaders, even security operative and legal practitioners who have been found to convince, connive, connive with the land grabbers in their devilish tendency. Hence this movement, despite being constitutionalized by few patriots, has within a short time become a mass movement of Edo people engaged land grabbing and under, underhand and hand dealing. Reason cannot be unconnected with the fact that many homes have turned out at one time or the other to the victim of this evil act, and this cannot be seen to thrive in our state with vibrant political traditional institution. We respectfully ask that this institution must, must now rise up and punish land grabbers. Their sponsor, at least, send a strong signal to persons who think they are scared, who, who, who are sacred cows and cannot be punished, no matter how many Edo, Edo home they steal from. Except we are unwilling to feed the rot in our community, then we may continue to pay lip service to critical issues. Otherwise, our people will still have some level of confidence in the resolve of government to practically appeal the instruments of the law in building a decent land regulating system that notorious land grabber with a big with a bag of complaints from their victim hanging on their neck we still gallivant freely on the street of Benin with disposition of nothing they happen leave world wondering how prepare the government and other relevant authority in fighting such evil in our dear state we strongly believe the, the, the PPP law 2001 has amended we surface in dealing with issues of land and property in a just state. Unlike the 2007 counterpart that was more like a toothless word, bulldog. We, at, we as a people present our community in good light if we must attract relevant economic giant. Edo has gotten to that stage technologically Politically, economically, culturally, and otherwise, where system will be seen to be effective, meeting popular demand for effective service delivery. We cannot be different, and the time to make that is now, as we say, and affirm no to land grabbing and other unpopular land dealing in a, those states. Conclusively, we have in the last two weeks received thousands of petitions. Uh, still receiving more. We will continue to transmit this petition to appropriate authority to ensure the, that victim of land grabbing get desired justice and attention. We are, we are also following the House of Assembly investigation, in, Investigative Committee to ensure that to ensure the right thing is what done. Believe me, this struggle has sparked up by the concerned citizen of a those state home and abroad. We part find justice, able, and global best met methodologies towards land, property, regulation, and management in uh, those states. People must be able to purchase land, develop with their two eyes closed. That, that is the door we aim for. For more, for, more, for more importantly, the palace and the government must develop practical policy program to protect to protect of to protect the right of property developers whether they reside 
in in a do or outside. This is our stand. Amanda, away to. Amanda, away to. Yes, sir. Uh, we want to say a very big thank you to our general coordinator general for the world uh, delivered message. And uh, the goal and objective is simple. Uh, you also agree to the fact that the challenges ahead and the efforts that have been put in place cannot be allowed to be swept under the carpet. Hence, the need for this consistent follow-up. Mm -hmm. And we must make that this is just a clear message to even those in the State House of Assembly that we are paying an undivided attention to the process. And we strongly believe that justice will be done. Just today, this morning, I received a call. You know, the last time we interacted here, we talked about somebody that fainted, well, that was still in coma, why his uh, property was demolished in Okoromi. The person died yesterday oh. in Europe. Oh. The man died yesterday. He never returned from coma. Hmm. He died yesterday. Oh, and I'm going to do... You, you know the man? He's my friend. He's yeah. your friend. Yeah. Very good. Oh. He died yesterday in Europe. I just received the call this morning. You can imagine. The man died yesterday. And you know, when somebody has worked for so many years, most of the time that is not your time, no matter the level of acceptance you get in Europe mm. or America, it cannot be compared to your acceptance at oh. all. Someone has suffered for years to raise resources. Those who cannot even buy 50 by 100, you tell them to go and work with their hands a busy demolition property worth of millions. Hmm. So we don't want to cry more than the beery, but I think we have to call on us all to give a minute silence as a form of respect to the, the demise of that our brother, despite the fact that we don't know him in person, mm -hmm. we've not meant, but at least we must give respect owing to the fact that our goal and objective is to put an end to land grabbing, which led to the death of this young man. Please, a minute silence. Let's stand up for a minute silence, please. May his gentle soul rest in perfect peace. Amen. Amen. So I want to say a very big thank you to everyone, and uh, I think uh, this is much we can take for now. So is there any other submission from somewhere? Yeah, thank you. Okay. Uh, okay. okay. I think we, 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 we have uh, some persons, we have some victims, although we are not going to be writing them now. We have some victims here who are... Who are, whose lands and properties have either been grabbed by those who believe they own the state or been demolished. So in any time, any time from now, we are going to be calling them to come and relay their deed to the public. Uh, meanwhile, I don't know if the press has one or two questions that they want to throw to the house so that uh, we can po po possibly articulate those issues before our people. Thank you so much, and God bless. Gentlemen of the press, please. I will be here. <coughs> My name is Dr. Wangwe. Right. I'm writing. I'm not really the speech. Yes. I said it all. Yes. Yes. But um, I just want to draw attention, because since this whole thing started from the protest to this movement, one single person had the finger Mm. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So what's the this group going to extend this to mm. others? Because there are so many mm. across the state. Okay. Sorry. Okay. Thank you very much, Mr. Ifosa. One Um, this agitation is bigger than the one of Okoromi, and um, so far, if you follow our social media platform, you will see the things that we've been doing since the protest we did on the 8th of August. Um, I will use on Saturday as a case study where 
uh, the land that was grabbed from a family for almost 40 years, if I'm not wrong, mm -hmm. was being retrieved on Saturday. And again, we have about 10,000 petitions tied up, submitted to us physically in our emails and via WhatsApp, uh, WhatsApp messages. So um, when we visited the SSG, he told us to submit any petition we receive to the CSO in Northern Castle, which we've been doing and we've been following up. So like I said earlier, it's not just about the OHE of Okorozi. It's just that we have petitions from the OHE, over a hundred petitions from him, just one man. So that is the reason it seems like your agitation is about him that because most persons, for this person that died, it was the same Okorozi. So if you start flogging this issue in the social or, uh, or social media now, they will say we are fighting the world already. So it is not a battle of the world at all. Okay. Okay. It's okay. a battle land grabbing in general. Okay. 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 You tend to be waiting for the government to take the lead. Um, like we all know as individuals, when we have a law, people execute the law. So what I would suggest that the group, with the capacities you have, you can push the law, you know, to deal with those who are responsible for this act rather than submitting a petition, rather than submitting petitions to the state government. I am not saying by this that the state government has no right you know, to collect such petitions from you. What the government has done, it has created a window by signing into law that act yes. that can make anybody prosecute those who have been involved in land grabbing or all other crimes. So for us, for me, I would suggest that rather than wait, rather than cry, rather than, you know, do all sort of things, follow the path of the law. You can make arrests. The law so permits that individuals can make arrests. So I think that is what I think this group should be doing. Okay, let me ask you something very small. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Practical example, you yes. No, you can uh -huh. So now the issue now is that, like what he said, yeah. from from as a an experienced society practitioner, what he just said, it is, is the major issue that 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 um, that make implementation of the law so difficult in Nigeria or maybe in a, a by extension in those states. Let's say, for example, the way we're doing BD, BDC must go. We did several campaigns, but the citizen refused to take ownership of such law to act on it. Like what you said, I said yesterday, I said yesterday, I went to one of my property. They came to me that I should give them money. Yeah. So that if I, me now, it's so or not today, I'm, I'm like in, yeah, involved yeah. in this struggle. They yeah, came to yeah. me, they were asking me for money. So, like, so I would rather join you because, because if the public doesn't take ownership by going out to you, to use the law because what they do, what they do in Nigeria is that you will be the one to fight for them. Like what we are doing right now, everybody here, everybody here, money, individually is involved in this press conference. You will donate money to fight. You will do protests to fight. You will read out the laws to people. Instead of to just from there take ownership and be to do what they are supposed to do, they will still wait. Ha! Ah, I went to my land, though. Somebody came home, they drive me. What are you supposed to do? Are you not supposed to use relevant laws to enforce what you are supposed to do? They came to me and said, I said that, don't you know government just make laws to prohibit what you are doing? I said, next time I see anybody here, just know that the story will not be sweet for you. I say, please, gentlemen, excuse me. And that does it. It's not just only land grabbing. It, it has to other, other things that we don't want to go, go into right now. So we need to be focused. So we are using this medium because blessing we speak on this matter too to tell the people take ownership of the of the of the law go to website of of the state government or ask for them look for the new law print it again in a digital uh, world have a copy read through so that you can know what to do and anytime you are you are called upon 
they are still there in the community as if like what we said here that like nothing they they happen yeah. uh, okay sorry. let me ben, let me just add to your question we 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 are not just against land grabbing primarily uh, as as a sole responsibility we are also looking at educating our people on the issues because we notice that a vast majority of people in our communities are grossly uneducated and that, that is where we come in as a group to ensure that we are able to expose or make known the laws, the existing laws of government to these people, to these persons who because of their uh, a lack of knowledge on issues have been victims unnecessarily of land grabbing and otherwise. My chairman has a, has a property. You can imagine if he wasn't as exposed as he is, he would be paying some kind of money to ensure that his land is safe. This is a land he has bought many years ago. Somebody submitted a petition this morning. A lady, she has been calling me since last week. This is her petition to the state government, to the speaker. It's a 50 by 100 at Oporomi community. The, what, she to, what she told me, this is an Efosa, Efosa, sir. This is another petition against Oporomi community. The, this struggle is not about an individual. It's too big for one individual to show that. So this, this is a 50 by 100 at Oporomi. She has already bought the land. The Okaigele of the community, Mr. Lokyo Sadiaye, has taken possession of the property and has demanded three million naira from this girl mm. before he can he can release a property to her. So these are the issues. Three million naira and the money she used to buy the land years ago is far below three million. You can imagine. Now she's been demanded three million to pay just to take a land back, a land she has paid for. The papers are here. The the receipts of uh, construction receipts is there. Her name is Julia or or, or Boroye. So these are the issues. And these things, we allow it to happen in our states, in our Never. city, in our land. Never. And we are here. It can work now. It can't work. We must find a way to stop and bring a practical end to these unpopular pra practices. We are not the only state where people sell lands in Nigeria. Uh, excuse me, excuse me, sir. Uh, the truth of the matter is very simple. Why we must understand something is this. We know that we have the capacity whatsoever to push to ensure that implementation sees the light of the day. But the current law on ground empowered a set, which is the committee that will be in charge. Are you getting the point? The PPP committee yes. will be in charge, certainly. You are going to report to them. So for now, we part of our agitation is that let this law take its course immediately and let those in charge, let us know them so that we can submit details to them even if we know that we can use other means but there's already a mechanism set by the adjusted government which we are calling on the government to make it a point of duty to start functioning so that at the end of the day we yes. can better tailor all our activities to that yes. Yes. tailor all our yes. okay uh, that's your no, question uh, Jonah will just yeah, ask. Yeah, so, yeah. so that he will address it at once. Okay, okay. Ben, please. The, mm. I think the, 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 the problem is not that the people are not willing. There is a connivance between the law enforcement agents, yes. those who are supposed to enforce the law, yes. with the people perpetrating this evil. Yes. You cannot imagine that going to police station to report the city or carry it to the police. Obviously, it's seen that my land has been right. trespassed upon. Mm -hmm. But before I get home, that man would have been released. And yeah, the next thing you course. see, they start calling you to threaten you. It happened to my cousin. They almost cut off his neck. It was at this place that it was resolved. You need to see police petting known criminals who have admitted that they did. They almost removed this his hand because he had to defend himself and the complex almost removed this his hand. So what I'm trying to say in essence is this. It's not that the people do not know that they should go to police station and report the people. We must tell the people that if you go to the police to report the people and you are not getting any form of justice, you can't come and report to us, we pick it up. 
We pick it up from any station. I don't that you have to eat, no, no, no. Okay. That is also where the media comes in. Like you also need to help us talk about these things in your programs on air on TV, so that people will be better informed that the consensus of those states they can actually bring their report to us and we help them blow them up. Yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah. Ben, just ask that we ask the BBC. The area, the area, I really want to talk on uh, what else has a. I've already said yes. Okay. He spoke extensively on what I was thinking. Okay. You know, the meeting, um, certain certain area of the law to a particular group. Yeah. Uh, it is not uh, definitely meant for the public to agitate for. Mm -hmm. So you have to wait for a certain group, you know, to yes, take the case right. while you submit your petition. Yes. But I still want to hold this group. Um, apart from that. There is another measure you can take, like you are doing, pressing more, you know, pressing more, and ensuring that your messages are taken to the corners. When I use the word, the corners, we don't have to face those who are uh, forbearers of these litigations. We have to face those who make the law, those who said the laws should be applicable to. Uh, against okay. those who are, you know, no, we're taking no, 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 we understand, we understand that point. Yeah. This is where I, I, I really want us to uh, uh, channel our agitations to. Yes, uh, picking the what's it called, um, petitions mm -hmm. is the right way. You now know where to uh, pick your point from because you cannot just start a fight, you don't know where it's going. Mm -hmm. uh, it's more like somebody going to say. I'm going to London and I'm, I'm taking through Nicoba as so you're lost already. So for me, I want us to continue to see it like the law has empowered this group. The law wasn't made for the animals. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, it was made for him and the positions you guys have taken, I think is the right position. For me, beautiful position, but never of your food from the pedals because a time will come you are going to justify what you have done so the real reason for this most i know it's very difficult to continue in this aspect uh, risky. particularly risky and for, uh, financially particularly the big wigs who are behind these mm -hmm. uh, elements element. mm -hmm. so okay that is what okay that Okay, BBC. Wait, let me no, 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 I think don't finish. No, 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 no. Okay, sorry. No, 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 no. All right. So, um, I I lodge that the whole essence of this um, setting should be rechanneled to the state government. He is the architect of the law. He is the one who says the law should catch up with those who have wronged the society. We shouldn't be thinking of, oh, hey, it's nobody. Look at yourself. Look at all of us. Look at these cameras. He cannot face it. But the truth is that those who made the law must come out through your agitation, the right agitation, so that they will know that people are not sleeping. I think that is all I want to say. Thank you, very much. Thank you so much, okay. Thank you. BBC. So much. Uh, 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 do I have one? Please go ahead. Okay, okay, BBC, do I be? BBC, I do. No, I'm not. Right. Uh, right. Uh, I'm going to tell you. 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 I mean, okay, bless okay, you. Okay, bless you. Uh, because uh, the Meme State and the Dev area. Now, Malaji, a community, my woman had 500 plots of photo banner. And no gay, all participative in it on our day. Okay, I or do we? Here you have to arrive. Can we do a youth because on air, or to make it, or on air, go make it. Agbo ya must ba on air one by two. Now, here we are, man, like in the middle of the day, and we are talking. 
So, I am not here with Otoria Weber. In your opportunity to set to every tree, the old so like me, Madame Defonave, if I worry. If I saw my mind so I develop and I ran out of my way, a guy on the way, here only a calf to lend it, Manali Pop Bania, me a yafu. A two beggar. So, I don't want any way, but I like the only water where any amoto who waver, when he had ten water. Yeah, it was sure. Wherever we could go, where we take one thousand plots in here. I will estate developers. We are my home where the side of Winya, what they buy because I like doing a video. We are right go near in here. Yeah, yeah, we have a top one. My way, the Muzala, the December. We might, you might have doctor on me. A youth in our river. Any other lady, my phone. You know, we're going to name. We're going to join. We're not going to What's that? For you, only a boy. But we did the right. My way, the right. Now we can imagine. I don't everybody could be an hour and go near an hour. So, you have to talk it. Where it's a developer kid or daughter, most of 500, 1000 plus. We are my girl or to any other year, move go, walk out of way. And I like the boss to know where you are. We are my girl. Everybody, if you don't talk, and you can't die, you are the developers. Anyway, I'll be going to say, 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 I'll be if you have a walk in your book, you may get away. The best in time by a matter no, or a video. You may have a time where you will up and you will be begging. You may have women to talk. No, don't talk about me. I have women to talk. Oh, Havana, or walking there with your book. You don't have a no, or not the best of the book. You know, 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 Runda, in everything, ni a yale le, okane, be, avi baba so ni de ba, be woni ya, ya dwe kini. So, evi me atabo la kena wwe, e mani kwa doto, ni a lao, evi ne bote ju diligence. Ni a ke kabo, kabo ba koto, na mye wwe, oto ni a de, mye wwe, e no gi, o jon wwe, e bie bo, e ma fe fe fe, no gi mo bo, e mo to ni ne ye, ye fe fe fe. Il y a un peu de temps, il y a un peu de temps. 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 Il a un peu de temps. Il y 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 a un peu de temps. Il it's just more or less like an enlightenment. Let them all go and look for job. All these land, all these um, uh, CDA land grabbers and the rest. Let them all go and look for job. Now let me tell you, if you want a door to be a better society, you are hiding in your community selling land. You are not productive. Your, ben your benefit is that you know how the reception is in a those days in every of the hotels. When land finish, the go where you take flight community matter, you carry enter street, begin look for you one good thief. The whole of them should go and look for a job. As we speak today, before 2017, CD activities was not illegal. And though government was even the one approving CDAs from community to community. The upper came to be. The governor came in now to say, now what we have been doing in the past, we say no, it has been proscribed. Stop it. You stop it. I go and look for a better thing to do. Now look at the statement made by our sister. When they buy land in the community, they give them the money. They share it. No development. Nothing. 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 Hospital. Uh, Are you getting, uh, listen, uh, listen to that statement. No. Uh, Hospital. They share it. They receive this money. They share it. Now, anywhere you are taking from, you are not filling it back. There's every tendency that problem 
will come. The truth is this, we are using this medium to call on them. In fact, it's just that we will not overpower government to not take charge of individual communities. But the way things are going on right now, <coughs> do you know the number of deaths that we record on a daily basis, unannounced, in communities? Mm -hmm. That was why we identified a timely death in the process. Mm -hmm. Youth amassing weapons. Every community wants to extend because when you have been, you you, you have you have mastered yourself with selling of lands, yeah. and lands are no longer in your community, and the next community has a new land owing to the fact that they, you have you have ended yours. The 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 the, 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 the land says it's fighting. not going to the next community. You now say I bring out the weapon. Hey man, now see man and lie. Now this side the pass. You start on that communal Very devilish practice. Communal war commences. On a daily basis, it's everywhere. So the point is very clear. Let the whole of them go and look for a job. If they must sell land in communities, let the elders and the youth find they will not come back to say, This is what we are going to do. Let's say, Let people go more into agriculture. Say, 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 say. Very new. So that is the point. We want to say a very big thank you to everyone. Is there any other question? Please, when you want to ask your question, identify your media, please. Uh, Nigeria Watch, why don't you ask a question? Nigeria Watch, okay. Uh, Nigeria Watch, uh, first. Uh, my what? name is Beatrice. I'm outside. No, yeah. Okay. Although this young man, Mr. Jonah. Jonah. I've said part of the. I want to say. Okay. You know, you're not going to know Jonah's name again. Yeah. Young man. Yeah, no. Now, one. Many of them, many of those individuals are developers. Yes. Like actually, before this time, try to arrest those yes. who are behind those illegal trade, this land grab. But one situation where a policeman is being beaten, even the victim in presence of police, mm. police will give them cover. Mm. They will beat nonsense out of those individuals. So, like what Eben also said, mm. is to put more light. Pressure on the state government yes. and the traditional institution yes. because those individuals let the fair to ourselves because they talk too much, they have not and they fear. They are adding on that these guys are traditional institution to perpetrate those their evils. Yeah. And we, that we should also put our searchlight on those areas. That's my submission. Thank, Thank you, you so much. much. Thank you so 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 it's about women that you can't go good there. So you also look at it critically. Yeah. Like uh, this uh, 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 this Obama, okay, Magba community Obama. and the other communities. Obama. We see a lot of people dying Obama. every day. We also have to draw the attention of the government. Also look into such things. If there's a way can engage the youth or do something that will make community be free for all. Thank you. All right. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, please go ahead. So also have to be the, uh, what have you said since? Say your name, or the secretary is not taking up. My name is Comrade Bill Okay. From which organization? President, Faculty of Peace Organization. I want to also have to this moral representation. And uh, it's like our community are being captured. The issue of leadership in community. Yeah. Okay. The issue of headship in community. You see. Some persons, mm. I would use uh, uh, the community mm. as, yes. a, as an example. Mm. The Okao, because mm. the head of that place is called Okao. Okao, yes. There was an existing headship there before. Mm. But something happened at 99. The, the headship transited from one family to another. As we speak now, it has been growing crisis mm -hmm. in that community. Yeah. Yeah. Gunshot daily killings daily in that community. And I don't think these are our community yeah. 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 What happened is that once one head who, who has been there before has been doing land dealings mm. and there is a transition in headship now, another head came. Automatically, all other uh, land transactions that have been done mm -hmm. in that community before is zero. Mm -hmm. That 
The new headship will not tell you that you are not you are not recognized. Even no continuity. Even though you bring your documents, your valid document to them, they will tell you go and meet the former headship who sold the land for you. And the former headship is, is not even relating. That one, in one way or the other, will still mobilize somehow and invade his own community. Yes. Invade his own people, killing his own people. Mm. Just to grab again the title of the headship. So I still want this uh, great movement to look into that uh, matter. From the middle, I think you are, you are very, very right in respect of uh, what you started at the community. Mm -hmm. You understand? There's classes that go to Egoso Nebuli, the center, and some other communities. Classes everywhere. What uh, those people that are opposing themselves, what they normally do is that they get uh, uh, some documents from, from, from the palace side by the traditional council. You understand? All that document will also come from the other side. You understand? Yes. Validating or invalidating. Yes. But you understand? No, no, yes. One or two things in respect of what is happening in the community. You understand? In law, in the not share, in the not share, the, the palace, sorry, some, some prominent chiefs in the palace are not to drop out the law yes. and they bring behind the crisis in the community. 80%. You know, that is the truth. You understand? I want to urge this. Uh, in fact, we are going to transmit a formal letter to the Oba of Benin to draw the attention of the Oba of Benin to imminent crisis. Yeah. And crisis are imminent crisis in communities. So that we want communities to live in peace and money and concord. It's just that we find ourselves in a society yeah. where yeah. we cannot just say it. Mm. Right. The victims. Yeah. No, I think no, they will for now. The the media, they, they will take it outside. Mm. Can you take them? No, no, no. No, no. no, no. no it's better they are taking outside. Mm. 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 They say, well, it, it, these are our own. They will just take them like that. Yes. Mm. Okay, so we'll come to the end of Yes. Uh, yeah. We've come to the end of the activities for the day, and uh, we are indeed very, very grateful uh, for those who made themselves available and to all our supporters. Around the world, we say a very big thank you, concerned citizens, the medias, and the members here present. Uh, because of the environment, uh, we said let's just take some few invitations. So, if for adventure you are not called upon, don't be angry. It's just that what needed to be done must be done and the environment in itself is not large enough to accommodate everyone that is not to say you have been relegated from the struggle no you are part and parcel of the struggle we want to thank all the medias and you have something to say yes um, um we just talked yes. about the support deal uh, we are planning on having a symposium it's going to be a very big one where we invite all stakeholders involved in land administration. Yes. We're inviting the land and surveys, the forestry, the urban and regional planning, the edogies, the Bini traditional council, this CBA, uh, these community leaders, you know, the government, MBA, security agency. They are going to be involved in this symposium. Where we're going to discuss about mm. these land grabbing issues extensively, mm -hmm. come up with recommendations and resolutions that will be presented to the government and the community to work with. So please, people should follow us. Stay tuned. Join us in this fight because we have a lot more to offer, a lot more to do. Thank you, so much. Thank, you so much. thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Call on our Vice President, Apostle Alfred Winosa. So close this session with a prayer. Thank you so much. Stand for God. We are grateful. Oh Lord. Oh Lord. Pastor Kola is We are grateful. And his spiritual leader. Lord, hallelujah. For all you have done. So, Evelyn.
Heavenly Father, we want to say thank you. Thank you. Thank you for this successful you, World Jesus. Press Conference against land grabbing in Edo State. Father, I want to say thank you because the evil works standing against the development of this state is coming to an end. Mm. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Lord, we ask, O oh Lord, I continue to grant unto us wisdom, Amen. knowledge, and understanding to carry out our daily activities against land grabbing in Edo State. In the name of Amen. Jesus Christ. Amen. Finally, O oh God, we decree no weapon formed against us shall prosper. Amen. Amen. Lord, for those seeking for justice, Lord, they will get justice. Amen. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Soli, 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 solidarity forever. So, so, solidarity forever. So, 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 solidarity forever. We shall always fight for our rights. Solidarity forever. So, 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 solidarity forever. So, 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 solidarity forever. We shall always fight in Soweto, in Africa. Amanda, I wait to be for Thank you, thank you, thank you. You find a way to. I beg, help us share this video and let us know what you think for comment section. If you never subscribe to Dan ARG YouTube, try make you subscribe so that make you for the hear all the things where they happen for Edo State. Make I leave you now with this video. Make you help us share them. Thank you for watching Dan ARG YouTube.